removing PCIe riser assemblies and adapters. If applicable, remove the security bezel. Remove the top cover. Note, if GPU power cables are installed, disengage them from the processor air baffle before removing the PCIe riser assemblies. To remove PCIe riser 1, disengage the signal cable from the space between the processor air baffle and the chassis. Loosen the two captive screws and then lift the riser assembly from the chassis. If the serial port module is installed, disconnect the serial port cable from the system board. Disconnect all the cables from the riser card. If necessary, proceed to remove the PCIe adapter. Loosen the screw that secures the side support bracket. Push the bracket slightly outward to disengage it and then lift it from the riser assembly. If necessary, remove the low profile fillers by pressing the tab on the fillers to disengage them from the side support bracket. Use a pointed tool if necessary. Open the retainer and then remove the screw that secures the adapter if applicable. Carefully slide the adapter out of the slot. Note, if no replacement adapter is to be installed in the slot, insert the slot filler and then close the retainer. If no full length adapter is to be installed in the riser assembly, remove the extender. To do that, loosen the two screws that secure the extender. Push the extender slightly outward to disengage it and then remove it from the riser assembly. If necessary, proceed to remove the riser card. Loosen the four screws that secure the riser card. And then lift this up. To remove PCIe riser 2, if the configuration has an internal drive cage, remove all the internal drives. Pinch the blue touch points on the backplane bracket and then lift the backplane. Place the internal drive backplane on the top of the fan cage for easier operation. Loosen the two captive screws and then lift the riser assembly from the chassis. Disconnect all the cables from the PCIe adapters and then place PCIe riser 2 on the front drive cage. Disconnect all the cables from the riser card. and then carefully remove the cables from the cable clip. If necessary, proceed to remove the riser card. Loosen the screw that secures the side support bracket. Push the bracket slightly outward to disengage it and then lift it from the riser assembly. Loosen the four screws that secure the riser card. and then lift this up. 